Sure, I work for Courageous Parents Network, which is an online web and mobile platform for parents and families and providers actually caring for children with a life-limiting illness. We offer, um, our primary asset on our website is a video library of over 700 video segments about topics that are, that rare disease families and families with children who have serious illness often face. So those could include uh, complex decision making, maintaining your marriage, caring for your other children while well, you're caring for a handicapped child, um, complicated things like anticipatory grief, understanding how you felt after diagnosis, um, and then of course addressing those families who have lost a child with some bereavement support. Our position is that families who are caring for children with serious illness regardless of their diagnosis face very similar issues and so we try to be a, a disease agnostic platform and focus more on the psychosocial emotional components of caring for these children and maintaining your family rather than the disease specifically. However, most families like to hear from somebody similar to themselves. So we do have the capacity on our website for you to watch videos from a family who might have had the same diagnosis as your child. Um, but we don't have every diagnosis represented on our, on our website. We, um, we, that would be nearly impossible to do. Um, so we welcome families mostly to come in and sort it by topic area so that they can see, as I said before, am I facing spinal surgery for my child? So maybe I can go and listen to another family who went through that. Or what my child needs a feeding tube. How do I figure out the decision making behind that? And you can watch an interview from a family who chose to get a feeding tube and one who didn't. And listen and, and sort of feel out what, how are you feeling about it and explore your decision making process.